ಹಾಗೆ ನಿಲ್ಯಾನ್ ಹೆಲೋ ಹೆಲೋ ಕೆನ್ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಯು ಹಿಯರ್ ಮೀ ಯಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಓಕೆ ಪರ್ಫೆಕ್ಟ್ ಹೌ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಗುಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ರೈನ್ ಇನ್ ವರ್ ಯು ಲಿವ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮೂಮೆಂಟ್ ಯಸ್ ಓ ಓಕೆ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಓಕೆ ಹಿಯರ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಐ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಕ್ಯಾಬ್ ಆಫ್ ಪರಾರ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ಡ್ ದ ರೈನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ರೈನಿಂಗ್ ಎನಿ ಮೋರ್ ಬಟ್ ವರ್ ಯು ಲಿವ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ರೈನಿಂಗ್ okay how are you how yeah. are you today um i'm tired tired i am yes. tired and bird to be i am tired oh ah, okay. i, I am. imagine i am yes it's toy i imagine Hard yes day. all day and what do you do in in your job um sail sail in line Ah okay you work in sales. Yes. Ah okay okay that's fine. Okay. Busy day I guess that you had in in the office or do you work online? Um I work only online. Ah okay in in your house you don't go out no sale you don't go out of your uh, house. Yes. I go up así se dice mm -hmm. or get up. Correct. Go. go out go up go up and visit my uh clientes serían mis a customer my uh -huh, mis customer okay i see okay good but no problem the class is only one hour one hour it, it passes quickly when you yeah when you realize cuando se da cuenta realize is darse cuenta uh this is not the document i'm going to close it this is the one when you realize the hour has passed cuando se viene a dar cuenta ya pasó la hora okay realize verb that means realize. darse cuenta yes realize realize okay when you realize It's 10 o'clock. It's pretty quickly. Es bien rápido. Okay. Uh, do you see the monitor, guys? Are you seeing what I share? Yes, yes. Do you do you see my screen? In my computer, I see that I am sharing. But if you want, you can confirm. that you see my screen could you yes. confirm ah oh, okay perfect perfect thank you all right uh, edson good evening welcome welcome to the class jancy thank you good evening. good evening thank you teacher good evening good evening joanna yesenia good evening too okay i was talking a moment ago with elena uh, she she sells she works in sales What do you do in your job, Jancy? Can you remind me? What do you do in in your job? Uh, repeat again, teacher, please. Sure, sure. Uh, what do you do in in your job? What's your occupation or your profession? What do you do, teaching, or you work in an office? or in a bank or in a hospital what is your your occupation or job nurse nurse i lawyer. am i am a, I, i am i am a, a nurse a nurse i am a lawyer i am a teacher i am a musician uh, how do you say how do you say uh, museógrafo uh, como administradora de museo no eh, la museografía eh, se encarga de del montaje de, de las exposiciones de la de la gestión de las colecciones y la museología se encarga de, de la Es como la ciencia que estudia del porqué los museos, la historia, para qué, la función. 
Ah, okay. Okay, I, good question. I, I, I wore, I wore, uh, I am a teacher okay. in the college. Uh, I am, and I am, uh, I am, no, I wore in the museum in the afternoon. Okay, cool. Interesting. Okay, the question that you made is a pretty good. Muy buena pregunta, okay? But the way that I can think that you can use is I work managing museums. Managing museums. Uh -huh. Yo trabajo administrando, okay? It can be any type of administration in the museum. This is one option. This is an option that you can use. I work managing museums. Trabajo administrando museums. All right. Thank you, teacher. Okay, that's one option. Another option is I work. Okay, I am a museum manager. Okay, administradora también. I am a museum manager. Similar, similar, similar option. Because of that is a, a, a term, I guess, museology. I have never heard about that. Museum, museology. Let's see the term. Museology. Museology. The science or practice of organizing, arranging, ahí está, arranging, managing, administrar, organizar, etc. And arranging and managing, aquí está. Here it is, I found it. In managing museums. But this is the science. The science. Esa es la ciencia de... But the person that practices that, la persona que practica eso, can say, puede decir, these two options. All right? Correct? Thank you, teacher. Okay, no problem. Good question. Okay, I learned uh, something new today. Aprendí algo nuevo hoy, ¿ver? Okay, I learned from you too. También aprendo de ustedes. Okay, good. Uh, guys, uh, welcome to the English class, class number seven. Number seven. Okay, we are advancing in the English classes little by little in the day after day. Today, we are going to cover uh, new things about the classes in your model. Okay, I won't repeat the the indications, you have heard them previously and you can uh, make them or practice with them. Practice the indications. All right. And we have questions and you can ask. Okay. Four areas. Number one is speaking, the one that we practice. Number two. Grammar and listening. Uh, the listening is number two. Grammar. Grammar number three. Uh -huh, number three and four. Practice. Practice, practice. Okay, good. And the links that we use. All right, let's go directly to today's topic. All right. Food, food, food. I like food. I like eating. Food. Food in res restaurant. Food in restaurants. Okay, question. Can you... Make, can you make the question or read the question, please? What's your favorite restaurant? Okay, it's singular, I only one. Only one, it can be only one. Question, yes, question. Eh, yo me acuerdo, creo que fue otro profesor, pero yo no entendía que él no pronunciaba la T, sino que decía restaurant. ¿Es así o se dice restaurant? Okay, this is uh, because it's the verb to be, what is, okay, or which one is, cuál es, no dice, what are your favorite restaurants, in that case, this one is singular, 
Okay, can you make it plural? Can you? Lo puedo hacer plural? Mm -hmm. What's your favorite, favorite restaurants? Okay, in the first sentence, the first sentence ah. is the verb to be. Okay, forget the contraction. Ah. Let's forget the contraction. Olvidemos la contraction, vaya. Uh -huh. What? Uh, Guys? Plural? Yeah. No, singulars. The first one is singular. The first ah. one is singular. What is? What is, correct. What is? What is? Your favorite restaurant. restaurant. Okay. Be ending with the letter T because it's singular. Okay, verb to be is is the form for singular. Okay, and in the plural. What are? What are? Que son? Which ones? Sería mejor which. Which ones? Cuáles? Mm -hmm. Are your favorite restaurants? Ah, okay, in this case uh, is plural because you are using once, está usando once, and you are using uh, mainly the verb to be in plural. In the sentence is correct. If, for example, if you have two favorite restaurants, uh, Elena, which ones are your two favorite restaurants that you prefer? I like Hudson and I like Puerto Marisco. Okay, those are two. And two is plural. And the sentence in that case is correct. But imagine if you only have one, the sentence should be singular. Si solo tiene uno, tendría que ser singular. What is... Yo creo que me expliqué mal. Oh. No entiendo eso. Solo que después en la palabra res... Eh, restaurant, yo escuchaba que él decía restaurant, no, no decía resta, sino restaurant. Ok, res, restaurant, like that. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok, yeah. let's check, let's check pronunciation, very good. That is very good because if you remember eh, in the classes, we can practice speaking listening okay you were practicing in that moment you're listening because i have one pronunciation for the word and the other teacher has maybe a small difference with the pronunciation okay you were practicing you're listening good okay and then we are practicing the speaking part and now we are gonna check Grammar. ahorita vamos a uh, verificar what Grammar no. and the phonetic, the phonetic part. Okay, let's see. Pronunciation of this word. Restaurant. Okay, there is one thing. Rest. Restaurant. Okay, mm -hmm. when, you when you see this, what do you think that this is, guys? When you, when you see parentheses in this part, in a letter inside of the parenthesis. Okay, this means that the vowel can be pronounced or not. Cuando está en parenthesis, quiere decir que la puede decir o no. Depending on the speaker, dependiendo del hablante. Puedo decir, rest restaurant, I am pronouncing the vowel, restaurant, or Rest, restaurant. Restaurant. Okay, it's almost the same, casi lo mismo. Okay. Restaurant. With a vowel, con la palabra. Guys, can you try? You can try, guys, you can try. The class is for everyone. Restaurant. Mm -hmm. Yo creo que no a todos les funciona el micrófono, Tisha. O ah, algo okay. Para... Porque miro restaurant. que hablan y no se escuchan. Yeah, okay. Maybe it's a raining where they leave it. That might be the, the issue. Okay, but no problem. Okay. Rest, rest, restaurant. Okay, restaurant. I am pronouncing the vowel. So pronunciando la vowel. Restaurant. 
restaurant. Rest, uh, okay, there it is. Ahí está. Rest, uh, restaurant. Restaurant. Okay. And without, without the vowel, y sin la vowel sonaría rest, and wow. then I jump to this okay. side. Salto a, de un solo a este lado, digamos, ¿verdad? Rest. Rent. Rent. Now, quickly. Y ahora más rápido. Huh? Restaurant. 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 Okay. Restaurant. Rest. Rest and rent. Okay. Restaurant. Together. Rest and rent together. Restaurant. Okay. Restaurant. But T, no letter S. No letter S. Maybe Restaurant. that is the thing. Tal vez por ahí va. Okay, some people pronounce it uh, with a vowel and other people omit it. Alguno puede pronunciarla o omitirla. That's why it's in parentheses in the phonetics. Por eso en el phonetic, el, uh, en el símbolo fonético, está en parentheses porque se puede omitir o se puede pronunciar. That is oh, the o sea, thing. De, la dos, de las dos formas. Both, both ways. Let's try to use English, both. Both oh. ways, teacher. Ah, okay. Both ways. Okay. Yes, both ways. Both right. ways. Yes, both ways. Ambas formas. Yes, that's why pronunciation makes a big difference when you speak. All right. That's why I teach I teach you the tools. Por eso le enseño las tools para que tenga eh, más recursos de cómo mejorar. Okay, porque yo puedo, puedo hablar, puedo estar talking all night, talking, talking, but I want you to, to see where or how the pronunciation is used in in the words. All right. Okay. Uh, okay. No, Joanna, we can't. We can't hear you. Maybe you have problems with the microphone, as Elena said. All right. Can you, that... teacher? Can you hear me? Yeah, I do. I okay. do, Edson, okay. no, more, no problem. Uh, Jose, Alvira, and let's see, Jancy, Jocelyn. Okay, welcome. Okay, uh, understood? Guys, yes. understood? Okay, that's why it's yeah. important to check the words when you have doubts or, or you think, ah, oh, no, I am, I am not sure about the pronunciation of this word. I'm going to check using the tools. It's a good idea to do so. Así que, por eso se revisa aquí. Ok, si ven, muy a menudo lo hago, para estar seguro. Ok, good. Uh, let's go to the class. Uh, we were already in class. Ya estábamos en class. Ok. Guys, uh, your favorite restaurant. Which one is it? Can you mention your favorite restaurant? Ok, Elena said, which restaurants are Elena's, uh, are uh, Elena's favorite restaurants, do you remember? Recuerden? Tucson and Puerto Marisco. En Puerto Marisco. Okay, Puerto Marisco is good. Edson and you? Which is your favorite mm -hmm. restaurant? Uh, my favorite restaurant mm. could be Cadejo. Uh, Cadejo. But Cadejo sounds like a bar more than a restaurant. But you can find food. You can find yeah. food. There is no problem. Okay, Cadejo. Okay, good. And uh, let's see, Jancy, yours. Carla Romero, welcome. Jocelyn. Favorite, favorite restaurants in San Salvador. Places, remember? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Welcome. Hi. Hi. I were there. Yes, we hear you, Carla. Favorite restaurant, which one is it? In Jancy. Biscuit Factory. Biscuit? What type of food is that one? Mm, pizza and mm. gourmet food. Ah, okay, pizza and gourmet sounds, sounds fancy. And desserts? Ah, uh, desserts, okay, good. Good, Jancy, and yours? Do you have any favorite restaurant that you like a lot? The following. Uh, cafe, cafe Metro, Cafe Metro, uh, Don 
is is excuse me for my okay, no problem no problem eh, no 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 quiero decir eso eh, café metro eh, is not restaurant because because eh, because eh, café metro buy no nice say vending me too ah, okay uh, Café Metro sales. Okay, simple present sell, is singular sell. sales. Uh -huh. Café Metro sales. Sell. Mm -hmm. sell uh, very good food. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know that. Like... I don't know that one. I don't know that one. Okay, but maybe I can find information about that uh, place. Metro Café Metro is right. No Metro Café. In front of no. Metro Sur, no. Eh, Similar, right? Next, next Metro Metro Galerías. Metro Galerías. Ah, okay. It's yes. it's remember where to be. It's next to it's next to uh -huh. try, metro try, metro. try to use it. It's next to Metro Galeria. All right, perfect. Okay, good. Uh, let's see in the chat. Joan is using the chat because. Charlie Boys, of course. <gasps> um, Cebollín is a restaurant too. Delicious, yes. Okay, good dishes. They got good dishes. Okay, good. Let's see. Ask and answer food and restaurants. Question, can you? How much do you like it? Okay. Hey, but you didn't ask me. You didn't ask me. Teacher, what is your favorite restaurant? Oh, my favorite restaurant is Charrua. You can find many types of meat. Okay, you can find pork, fish, beef, etc. It's delicious. Okay, the first uh, the first question in this part is How much do you like it? How much? How much do you like uh, Puerto Marisco, Elena? How much? I A love lot. it. <laughs> you love it. You yes. love seafood. Okay. And Jancy? How much do you like it? I like it, Metro Cafe, because, um, how do you say, variedad? Uh, okay, but, but just a moment. Uh, the question is how much, how do, much? You, uh, do you like it? It's not why, it's uh, how much asking for a degree in preference. Okay, uh -huh. I like it. I like it or I love it. Okay, but I, how much, I cuánto, like cuánto, how much? A lot, a little bit. Uh -huh. How much do you like it? Only I like it. Okay, uh, I like it. Okay, that's it. Simple. It's simple, pero está bien. Okay, good. And yours, uh, Elvira? Elvira, hello. Good evening. Do you have a microphone, Elvira? No? Yes? Okay, you can use the chat. Uh, Edson, in your favorite restaurant, how much? How much um... do you like it? Okay, my favorite restaurant, uh, for example, Buffalo Wings. Okay. Uh, I in loving, in loving. Okay, in let's loving mention. A lot. I love it. Okay, I like it. Let's see the options. We have options. I like it. Normal. I love it. Uh -huh. I love it. What else? options i need it i need it mm, i need it lo necesito i need it i need it mm, okay i need it is not talking about a degree in preference no se refiere de, en un grado de preferencia no degree in preference we are talking about preference 
Okay, we can use these options. I like it, I love it, I love it a lot. Mucho, I love it a lot. Uh -huh. What else? I hate it. Ah, okay, this one is acceptable too, but this is in a negative context. I hate it, okay? I hate it, it means that you don't like it. You don't yeah. like it, but it's correct too. I hate it, no, the restaurant is not good. It's horrible, food is awful, the service is bad, etc. And you say, I hate it, okay? It is correct, it is correct. You are referring uh, about a degree in your preference, even though it's negative, okay? This is affirmative in preference, affirmative, affirmative response. Any other that you, that you uh, may know? Alguna otra que pueda conocer? Este, no se puede utilizar so, so. De qué forma? Uh, using the subject, yes. Usando el subject, sí. Ah, the buffalo wings is, uh -huh, buffalo, okay. Buffalo wings, let's say, is, mm, in preference, is, so, so. Okay. Using the subject, yes. Usando el subject, yes. Is correct. Okay. To be specific about the place. All right. Okay. Okay, in many cases, gotta be, you gotta be specific when you refer to something. In this case is one example. I like the Viennese restaurant, but the first, the attention of the staff and second is the food you. Okay, that is your opinion. That means that you like it. And Joanna, you like the Savoyenes. All right, good. Any other option for preference degree? Remember, degree in preference, grado de preferencia, degree. Okay, let's continue then. Next question number two, WH. We are studying WH questions. How many times do you visit? Okay, do you visit it? Do you visit it? The, do you visit the restaurant? How many times do you visit your favorite restaurant? In a month or in a week? I visit once in a month. Okay, once in a month. Once a month. Once a month. Uh, once okay, a month. which which day? Which day? Mm, maybe Saturday or Monday. It's, it's, okay. a special day. Ah, in a special occasion or for a special day. Okay, good. Uh, remember something, remember something. When you are referring to uh, days of the week, use on. All right. You can say, which, which day do you visit your favorite restaurant? Ah, uh, I visit my favorite restaurant mm, on. On Mondays or on a Monday, once a week, okay? Or Saturday can be any day. On a Saturday, once, uh, the expression time, can you repeat it? Once a month. Once a month, ah, okay. I visit, read it, try to practice that, the structure, I visit, I visit my favorite. I visit my favorite restaurant. Restaurant. Uh -huh. Restaurant. Okay. On a, On a Saturday. Saturday. Once a month. Once a month. All right. And this is complete. See how many words do you practice? And if you say, or if you pronounce a sentence, or if you read it, how many words do you practice when you say it? How many? Uh -huh. I visit my favorite restaurant on a Saturday once a month. Okay, 
But question, li listening. 11. Ah, okay. 11. 11. How many words do you practice? 11 words. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. But if you say um, on Saturdays, okay, on Saturdays, how many, how many words do you practice if you say this answer? 15. Uh -huh. 15. No, nope. on the second. This is, this is like uh, a second sentence. Individually. Uh, two. Uh -huh. <laughs> Only two, right? Imagine, okay. What is the best way to improve your speaking English? With the sentence ones or sentence number two? Sentence ones. Of course, that with the sentence one. Okay, you practice the subject, the verb, um, all the complement. You practice the word that we practiced a moment ago. La que practicamos hace un momento. You practice, uh, what else? This is. Uh, ah, yeah, I forgot. Um, I forgot. Which one? On. On, but I forgot the name of the of the word. Uh, okay, you practice the day and the expression time. You practice a lot of things, but with the short sentences or short answer, that is that is okay. That is okay too, but you practice more with long sentences okay you are speaking okay this answer is correct is fine but try to practice with a complete sentence is is better all right clear 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 okay good 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 no no bad no bad no estuvo mal but you know the difference okay good next next wh question what do you order there? Okay, tell me. What do you order in your favorite restaurant? What do you order? What speaking, is speaking time, remember, speaking. Speaking is speaking. What do... Okay, I will start. In my favorite restaurant, I order uh, a piece of beef. Or I order chirimol. I order sangria. I like that drink. I like it a lot, that drink. I order, let's see, what else? Uh, bread and garlic. Okay, I am mentioning ingredients and preparations too. And you guys, what do you order? How do you say cocktail? A cocktail. Let's see. Let's uh, let's uh, review the word. Okay. Let's use the tools. Let's use them. Cock. I guess that this is the word cocktail. Cocktail or or K. Mm, let's check. Ceviche. No. Ah, this is the one. Ah, this is the one. Yeah. Ceviche in Spanish. This is the word. CK, it was, it was CK, era CK, okay. Cocktail. Repeat it, can you try to pronounce it? Cocktail. 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 Okay, ceviche, cocktail. All right. Uh, yeah. Okay, but the, which type of cocktail? Do you eh, order? Conchas y se me olvidó el nombre en inglés, camarón. Ah, ok. Conchas. En inglés, yeah. conchas, conchas. En <laughs> inglés. Shrimps. Shrimps, camarones. Shrimps. Oh. Shrimps, mm. camarones. Conchas. Shrimps. Ok. Oysters. Mm, oysters. It would be ostras, serían ostras. Okay, no, let's, no. Let's, let's find out. Conchas in English. Okay, because that is, that's not a common word. Mm, black, black shells, you can refer to black shells. Black shells. Black shells. 
Yes, because when you open them, cuando las abre, they are black inside, right? Entonces la oración sería I order. Correct. ¿Cuál es la palabra? Shrimp. Okay, I order shrimp. Mm -hmm. uh, a shrimp. Uh -huh, shrimp. A shrimp. A shrimp. Okay, the word yeah. is in. With. In black. No, Black. Sería with. Yes. And. And ah. or with. Doesn't matter. No importa. Está bien. I order a shrimp with black, black. shells. Black shells. And with a beer. Oh, okay. For drinking. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's, that's cool. No problem. That's fine. Okay. That's. That makes a, a good contrast. Okay, this is the order of the sentence. And the rest, okay, and Jancy, Jose Daniel, and you, and Edson, Jocelyn, Carla, what uh, do you order? In my case, teacher, I order chicken wings buffalo. Okay, delicious. Spicy or not spicy? Spicy. Okay, spicy chicken wings that is the order i order a spicy chicken wings spicy chicken wings okay good uh, celia mario kenya we are talking about restaurants and the food that you order in those uh, restaurants okay anybody else huh i order vegetable Esta mol, eh, salad, así se pronuncia, teacher, yes. salad, 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 and, correct, salad, and, and dessert. A dessert, a dessert. What type of dessert? dessert? What type? What type of dessert do you order? I order. Hi. Yeah, yeah, we hear you. Yeah, continue. You can. I order pupusas. Oh, okay. I like pupusas. Mm -hmm. Okay, in, in with, which, in... with with a Coca Cola. Uh, Coca Cola. That's in Spanish. With a Coke. With a Coke. Uh -huh, with a Coke. Con una Coca. Okay, with a Coke. All right. Good. Delicious. Okay. Uh -huh. Yep. I order. I order gray meat, carne asada. Ah, okay, roasted, roasted meat. Right. Ah, okay, roasted, but in which restaurant? In which one? In which restaurant do you order that dish, Celia? In which one? Which restaurant? Uh, I don't know. La Casona, maybe. La Hacienda. Oh, Pero la cebollina. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok. Los cebollines. Ah, ok. At, at los cebollines. Mamachus. Ah, at mamachus. Ok. Or mama rosy too. That's a la good pampa. place. No. La pampa. Ok. If you, if you have enough. Si hay, si hay suficiente, right? You go to la pampa. All right. Yes. What else? ¿Qué más? Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, and for drinking, for drinking, or to drink? No. no. Okay, Joanna orders grilled meat. Oh, delicious, grilled. A la plancha, and grilled. All right, good. For drink, no drinking, no drinks. All right, no problem. Let's continue with the next one. We are almost done we are almost done okay i know this is number three was the last one but we have an an activity activity let's let's develop the next activity about food and restaurants about food and restaurants okay this is the link and when you have links what you can do is uh, select it and copy copy the link or if not 
when the link is like this, cuando el link está así, you uh, press the control key, presiona la control key, and there is the head. Hay una manito ahí. Do you see it? Yes? And you hit yes. enter. Okay, when you hit enter, it will take you to the website. All right. The activity is about... Okay, the title. Title, title the is... Restaurant. Food, food and restaurant. Food and restaurants in plural. Here is in plural. Food and restaurants. Okay. Do you... Do you like... All right, good. Uh, do you like uh, eating out? Guys, do you like eating out? Yes. Yes, I like it. Yes, yes I, like. I like it or yes, I do. Uh, we have two options. You can answer, ah, yeah, I do, I do, or I like yes. it, or yes, I like it. Sí, sí me gusta. Okay, check out these reviews of the trendiest. What is it? What is the trendiest? Trends. The trendiest. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When you say, ah, the most modern restaurants in the city los restaurantes modernos o tendencias más, yes correct tendencias okay or los más modernos that is the meaning the trendiest places like, okay uh, plural places repeated places to eat like, and improve mm -hmm. to eat and improve yes yeah. your reading, reading Skills. Right. Okay, good. Okay, there it says, Elvira says, I ask for, uh, pido, ask for is a verb. Ask for. Uh, ask for is pedir. Uh, I ask for, but when you are talking about food in restaurants, the, the verb in the normal verb is order. You can use order. You order, but you can say I ask for mm, yes, but in, in talking about restaurants and food, is order, order not order. Okay, no problem. Yes, order. Okay, uh, this is a reading uh, exercise in fifteen minutes. I don't think we can finish, but let's see. Instructions do. To the preparation exercise first, then do the other exercise. Okay, let's see. Do the preparation exercise first, and then do the other exercises. Okay. The preparation says match full pictures. Okay, let's match the the words with the pictures. The first picture is coffee. 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 Uh, let's see if we have coffee. Cappuccino. There is no coffee in the words. It's a cappuccino. Cappuccino. Uh, cappuccino. It's a, an Italian word, I guess. Italian word. Okay, cappuccino. Uh, and this one? Maybe milk Uh Which one? Oh, Fruit, 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 smoothie, mm -hmm. smoothie, or smoothie. Three smoothie. pronunciations. Which one is the correct one? Fruit, smoothie. Mm -hmm. Smoothie. Smoothie. Mm, I don't know. Or a, or a smoothie. Let's see. Okay, let's use. Okay, I'm going to use the second tool. Okay, that's why I tell you, use the tools to improve. Uh, I use the tools to improve. Let's see. Smoothie. 
smoothie. smoothie. Ah, no. with the letter D. D seems. This is a letter D. This is a D. In the phonetic. Uh -huh, it's a moody. Smoothie. It's a moody. Okay, let's see in this one the same symbol. El mismo symbol, or D. Smoothie. Okay, smoothie. Now you know. Ahora ya sabe, no vaya a pronunciar. Smoothie or smoothie is smoothie. 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 All right. Okay, the smoothie goes here. Uh, next. Oh, my favorite. Yes. My favorite food. Uh huh. Steak. A stick. A stick or a steak. Or a steak. A steak. Ah, steak. I, do you remember the yes. restaurant a Steakhouse? Yes. Ah, yes. Okay, that one. Okay, a steak. Yes. A steak. Ah, pretty easy, this one. Pizza. 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 Pizza or a pizza? Pizza. Mm -hmm. Pronunciation thing. Pizza. Oh, okay. People pizza. normally say, las personas normalmente dicen pizza. Yes or no? I say pizza in Spanish. I say pizza. But because we are studying English, it should be? Pizza. Pizza. Uh, <laughs> pizza, pizza. Okay, pizza, pizza. Like the, the commercial, <laughs> right? Pizza, pizza. Okay. Uh -huh. What is that? What is that pizza? Pizza Little brand? Caesar. Little Caesar. Okay, of course. Okay, pizza is not pizza, it's pizza. Pizza, pizza. Okay, next. Conchitas. Conchitas is in Spanish. And the word is? Pasta. Pasta. Correct. Pasta. No conchitas. And this one? Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm. English breakfast. That's an English, an English breakfast. Okay, English people eat all of that. So that's a common English people. Imagine ingredients. Ingredients? Tocino. Uh, tocino in English? Say tocino. Uh -huh. How do you say? How do you say? Ask. Use the question. How do you say tocino in English? Okay, but you should do or you should make it the question. Usted debería hacer la pregunta and practice the question. How do you say, teacher? How do you say tocino uh -huh. in English? Ah, easy. Bacon. Kevin, <laughs> Kevin Bacon, the actor. <laughs> Kevin Bacon, remember. Ah, uh, Kevin Bacon is the actor. Bacon is the food. Okay, and uh, these ones? Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Okay. Mush. ¿Qué es mushrooms? Hongos. <laughs> Hongos, oh. okay. Toasts, tostadas, toasts. Uh, scrambled, scrambled. The word is scrambled. Is, is scram, is scrambled eggs. Is scrambled. Mm -hmm. Yes, is scrambled eggs. And these ones, yes, that's. Salchichas de desayuno, como digo, teacher. How do you say? How do you say? Uh -huh. Okay. Breakfast, uh, breakfast, so, sausages. Sausages. Breakfast, sausages. Okay. Look at how much we are practicing and we are not in the main activity. Mire cuánto estamos practicando y no estamos en la actividad principal, ¿sí? Sausage. 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 Repeat it, practice it, please. Sausage. 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 Okay. But in plural is sausages. 
Yes. Sausages. Sausages. Salchichas. Sausages. All right. Uh, let's come back. Come back. Come back. Uh, okay. What else? Do we have more? I must. No, right? Eight in the fish. In the hamburger. Uh -huh. Where Where are they? Ah, uh, they they are. Fish. Do you like fish, guys? Do you like fish? Yes, I like it. I love it. I love fried the fish. I love it. Okay, and the last one is hamburger. 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 All right. And those are the words already matched uh, with uh, the pictures. Okay, let's see. We are not going to complete the, the, the whole activity, but let's read a little bit, a few minutes. Okay, reading, uh, let's see. The ones who have microphone, los que tengan microphone. Uh, let's see, uh, Jocelyn, do you have a microphone? In this moment, yes, no. Okay, uh, Edson, help me in this part. Okay. This, this part. Okay, food and restaurants. Are you looking for somewhere special to go this weekend? Do you want to try something new? Check out one of these hot new restaurants. Okay, first restaurant. Last days of the Ra. Uh, centrally located. India, Indian restaurant. Uh, perfect for eating before or after the, the cinema or a show. In summer, enjoy. Uh, your meal in the beautiful garden. The most popular dishes are lamb and chicken cooked with meal, medium or hot spices or bread. Customers, there is extra hot. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's pronounce the words located. 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 Okay. All right, let's see. The next one is uh, da, 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 uh, lamb. 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 What is lamb? Uh, no, no idea. The food, okay. type of food, lamb. Let's see some pictures. Uh huh. Oveja. <laughs> uh, no, sheep is oveja. Sheep is different. Sheep. Is oveja, but sheep you cannot eat sheep. No puede comerse una oveja, right? Ah, cordero, yes. Cordero. I don't know. I don't know how sheep taste. I don't. I can't imagine. <laughs> I can't imagine how sheep taste. Como saben las sheep? Cordero, yes. Lamb. Cordero. Correct. Okay. Let's pronounce cooked. 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 With, the, with the letter T. This, words, this word has pronunciation T. Okay. With meal or mild? Mild. Mm, let's find it out. Let's find. Let's find it. Encontremosla. Is? Mild. 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 Okay, mild. Uh, okay, mild, not strong, and you get definitions. Okay, but he's talking about food. A medium, medium, medium. or hot, mm. or hot, spices, His spices, or his pieces, his spices, right? His spices, correct. For Brave, brave, repeat, brave, brave, customers, para clientes, Customer. valientes, brave, uh -huh. para clientes valientes, dice, there is extra hot, hot, do you like hot, uh, spicy, or hot, food that is hot, or spicy, mm. yes, I like, I yes. don't, 
I don't. I don't like spicy food. I can eat it. No la puedo comer. It's, I don't know. Okay. I don't resist. No resisto. Spicy food. Resist. Verb. This is a verb. Resistir. I don't resist the spicy food. Resist it. All right. Uh, guys, um, if you want, but I would advise, si usted quiere, pero aconsejo, ¿verdad? You can, you can read the complete paragraph and you can, you can read it in order to uh, practice the pronunciation of the words. And after the paragraph, all of them are uh, restaurants. Todos son restaurants. This one, this one, this one, all of them, todos. And after that, at the end, después de eso al final, there are two sections. Hay dos secciones. Check, check your. Mm -hmm. Okay, check, check your, your understanding. understanding about the reading activity. It is about matching, matching uh, answer and question or a sentence or word in definition, etc. It can be different. Or multiple selection. Multiple selection. After the reading, you can complete those two sections in order to check your understanding. All right, this is like a free practice that you can do in your house and when you when you have time. All right, uh, it's already almost or almost it's 10 o'clock and you can go, you can leave the class already. It's time for resting. All right, uh, guys, thank you very much for joining to the class. And see you tomorrow for another lesson in new things. Tomorrow, teacher. Yes. Good night. Good night. Have a great night. Thank you. See you. Bye bye. Have a great night. Take care. Good night, teacher. Have a great night. Thank you, Cecilia. Bye bye. Bye, Jose. Okay. Take care. See you tomorrow. Celia, Elvira, and Elena, thank you. See you. Thank you, teacher. Blessing. blessing. My pleasure. Blessings for you, too. Thanks. Thanks thank a lot. You.